Hello guys, welcome to 3mm, 3 minutes master. Here we go with LZ Flader. When we have multiple options to select, we make use of multi-way selections. They are categorized into two types. One is LC Flader and the other one is Switch. Here we will explain LC Flader. In my next video, we will explain Switch. In LC Flader, each else is associated with another if statement. The logic of else if be like, first the condition is evaluated. If it's false, we have another condition to evaluate. Again, if it's false, we do have another condition or statement with respect to your problem. If first condition is true, straight away, it executes certain statements and comes out of this entire LC flader structure. If first condition is false and second condition is true, then we have certain statements to execute and the control comes out. Now, let us see the basic syntax of nested if. Point number one, if condition one is true, these set of statements are executed. Point number two, if condition one is false and control verifies condition two, if it's true, these set of statements gets executed. Point number three, if condition one and condition two both are false and condition three is true, these set of statements gets executed. Now finally, the last point is, if all the conditions above are false, final else block gets executed. Kindly note, the simple else is to be placed at the last. Now, in order to get a proper idea, let's have an example for printing grade with respect to marks. The logic be like, first, m greater than or equal to 60 is verified. If true, it prints grade A. If false, it further checks for next condition that is m greater than or equal to 50. If verified, it's true, it prints grade B. If false, it checks for another condition m greater than or equal to 40. If it is verified as true, it prints grade C. If false, that is all the conditions are failed, then it prints fail and control gets exited. Now let's have a sample program to check 45's grade. For this, first 45 is assigned to M and checked with the condition that is M greater than or equal to 60. That is 45 greater than or equal to 60 as it returns false. Control checks another condition with else if that is M greater than or equal to 50 as 45 greater than or equal to 50 condition is false. Now, control checks another condition which is m greater than or equal to 40. As we know, 45 greater than or equal to 40, the condition is true. It prints grade C. The same grade C is printed as output. Thanks for watching our video. For more videos, do subscribe to our channel 3mm 3 Minutes Master. If you like, hit the like button and bell icon there and do share with your friends. Don't forget to drop a comment. 